turn number four. Scully gets the jump, leads the charge down into turn number one. Off of turn two, Scully in that number five truck, black and white. He's the leader right behind him in the white number one, Tim Bolger. It's going to be a battle up front. Scully is the leader across the stripe as we have a caution. Caution flag is out. A couple of trucks involved. It looks like the... 79 of Danny Tebow and the 17 of Rick Stockwell together off of turn number four, under, bringing us under yellow on lap one. And go when they come back around. Scully on the inside. Morgan up top. Scully looking for his second career sports truck win here tonight. Leads the charge off of turn number four. Gets a good jump ahead of Morgan with the one of Bolger glued to his rear bumper through turns one and two. Bolger right to the rear bumper of Tom Scully the third as they go down the back stretch. The advantage to Scully into three and four. Bolger closing and it's two by two behind them. Amy Arsenal works her way up to third with Jake Veneta up on her tail through the corners. Morgan backsliding on the top side as they head down the back straightaway. Veneta up to fourth. Morgan trying to slam the door down to the inside. Here comes Ethan Heilborn down low. The 80 of Mike Cavallaro up to the outside as they try to split her down the front the stretch. 57 of Morgan was preventing a hornet's nest behind her there as there's movement down the back stretch. It's going to be three wide into three and four. The Bristol Toyota pace truck pulls down to the infield. We're ready to go with two laps up on the board. The five of Tom Scully, the third, the one of Tim Bolger off the corner. Get up on the gas. Bolger falls back just a little bit with Arsenal filling the hole down to the inside as they hit turn number one. It is Scully and Bolger, one and two. Bolger back up on the outside. On the inside, Amy Arsenal making her move as they cross the stripe. Amy Arsenal running third, Jake Venator in fourth up front. It is a battle for the lead on the outside, Bolger, and a caution in turn number one and two. Dan McGee went down the front straightaway, and it didn't seem like that truck wanted to turn at all in contact with the 77 of Lenny Guy. Puts us back under caution with now three laps complete. Wait, two, two, three, two, four, two, nine. They're set to go here. As green flag in the air, Steve Bowden waves it. Tom Scully the third jumps right back out there to the lead. Bolger is going to be on his outside looking for the lead down the back stretch. Tim holding on strong up top as they hit turns three and four. Jake Veneta hanging tight on the outside of Amy Arsenal for that fourth and third spot. Settles it in back behind while Bolger continues to work up top. Wheel to wheel at the top of the field. They roll down the back straightaway. Here comes Bolger edging out for the lead trying to set the pace off of four and put the one to the top of the leaderboard. He does it lap number five. That he does down into one and two. Give the advantage to Tim Bolger off of two down the back stretch. Tim Bolger, your new leader, as they are single file for the first six positions. Mike Duart slides out of line, takes a look to the outside of Marissa Morgan, trying to work her, his way up towards the top of the field. The podium finish on opening night, trying to follow that up here tonight. That is the battle for fifth down the back straightaway. Behind them, Darrell Church holds off the charges of Rick Martin and Ethan Heilborn to race side by side right behind him. Out front, down into one and two, that number one truck, red decals, blue outline and a white truck. Tim Bolger, your leader, into three and four. Jake Veneta now slides up to the outside lane one more time to the on Amy Arsenal as they head down it to one and two. Amy looking underneath the five of Scully as they hit turn number three. Nine laps up on the board this time. Veneta loose off the corner, gathers it back in, sliding down the front straightaway into turn number one. Scully again opening up that bottom lane, but not enough. Caution flag out. Trent Rodriguez going around off of turn number three. And with nine laps complete, we are slowed up for the fourth time. That battle for fifth come around off of four. A race that has been slowed by four cautions in nine laps so far. See if they can get a little momentum going. Steve Bowden waves the green flag. Green back under it. Way. Tim Bolger leads the field down into one and two. Problems for Darrell Church. A right rear tire goes down just as the field goes to green and right back to yellow. And a tough break for Darrell, who is restarting seventh, having that right rear tire go down just as they were coming to green. As that will slow things down again. Everett's Auto Parts is celebrating 70 years.
plus. Nine laps up on the board. The Bristol Toyota Pace Truck pulls down to the infield, and Tim Bolger brings the field off of turn number four. Tom Scully the third up on the outside as they come off the corner. Scully with a good jump up on the outside, leading it down into turn number one. Bolger trying to battle back down to the inside. They try to split Bolger down the back stretch with Veneta up top and Arsenal taking a look down low. Here comes Veneta looking for that second position. He's running third. Scully crosses the line as the leader there. Bolger on the inside battling for the lead down the back stretch. Bolger dives down to the inside lane one more time, keeping the five up top as they come off of turn number four. Bolger gets a half a truck length advantage and Veneta trying to hold that bottom lane as tried to squeeze out Amy Arsenal. That time he did on Mike Duart as they head down into turns three and four. Right now, the battle is for second. Amy Arsenal continues that bottom run in the Helger South Coast Power Equipment number nine. Amy Arsenal making her name known there. Takes over position number two from Tom Scully the third down the back stretch. And here comes Jake Venator on the low line. He looks for third and he will take it from Tom Scully the third. Scully gets caught up on the outside. Backsliding he is as they hit turn number one. The 50 of Duart work in the inside lane there as they roll down the back straightaway. Mike Cavallero breaking free from Marissa Morgan's battle into the sixth spot as he gets loose off of turn four. It's all Tim Bolger up front right now as that number one truck leads. And Amy Arsenault is right to his back bumper into three and four. Jake Veneta in third right now. It, it is a battle up front. Cavallero backsliding just a little bit more. Here comes Marissa Morgan back down low with Rick Martin right behind that battle. That is for sixth, seventh, and eighth. Those three trucks battling into turn number three. 10 laps left to go here in this one. 16 down, nine to go as Bolger is your leader, Amy Arsenault in second. Trouble down at turn one, Marissa Morgan gets loose, DJ Tebow spinning to avoid as he jumped on the brakes and had the back end start to slide out from behind. Tim Bolger ready to wind it up off of turn number four, looking for career win number one. Gets a good jump on the inside with Arsenal caught up top as they hit turn number one. They are still wheel to wheel at the top of the field as they roll down the back straightaway. Veneta now sliding underneath as she looks for he looks for a number two spot. Jake Veneta in that white number 29 Everett's Auto Parts truck. He is going to push for second place down into one and two. He battles with Amy Arsenal door to door. Caution flag out for the 55 of Dan McGee as he struggles to get that truck back into the pit area. And uh, right away, we're back under yellow at lap number 17. Into the infield, we will see the green flag. As our leader, Tim Bolger, takes him to the green flag. Eight more times around, down into one and two. Give the advantage to Bolger. Amy Arsenault right there on the outside. Here comes Jake Veneta down into three and four for position number two. Give the advantage to Veneta off of four. Jake Veneta to second place. Veneta with a good run down to the inside, takes over the number two spot. Arsenal settles in for third, and here comes Duart up top, trying to even up for third in the turn number three. Jake Veneta in turn three and four. He is going to get right to the rear bumper of Tim Bolger. Tim Bolger looking for his first career win. If Jake Veneta has anything to say about it, that won't happen. Veneta down the back stretch in second as Tim Bolger continues to lead as we come to five laps to go. Five more circuits to go for the youngster setting the pace in truck number one. Leads the charge by two truck lengths over Jake Veneta, Amy Arsenal in third, Mike Duart fourth, and Tom Scully the third, rounding out the top five, Rick Martin and Mike Cavallero with the first battle on the field. Here comes Martin getting the run. Takes a look down to the inside of Tom Scully the third. Scully tries to close the door. There's contact there as they come off of turn number four, turn number two. Martin's able to get away, but the five of Scully gets caught facing the wrong way. It'll be f one and two. Amy Arsenal, Mike Duart. Third and fourth, Tom Scully, Mike Cavallaro, Danny Tebow, Ethan Heilborn, Dane Saratelli, and Marissa Morgan. Shriners Hospital has the vision to transform children's lives by providing exceptional health care through innovative research in a patient and family centered environment. Go to www.shrines. Tim's looking to break through for victory for the first time. 
Bristol Toyota Pace Truck pulls down to the infield grass, and we're ready to go. 21 laps up on the board, four laps remain. Tim Bulger and Jake Vineda round off of turn number four. Green flag is out. Bulger with the jump. Here comes Arsenal down to the inside of Vineda. That's the battle for second. Nope. Make Jake trouble for Cavalero as Mike goes around off of turn number four. Oh, and Trent Rodriguez makes contact. And we are slowed up one more time. Cavalero with some heavy body damage on the right side and possibly some suspension damage to the right rear of that number 80. The beautiful wrap job done by Higher Graphics over the winter adorned in the Bolger. Veneta, your front row. Does Jake Veneta have enough? Green flag back in the air. Tim Bolger, your leader. As they work down into one and two, Amy Arsenault on the low side will battle with Jake Veneta. Give Veneta the advantage down the back stretch for the second position as he goes for the lead. Bolger gets a great jump and sets the pace. Three to go. Arsenault battling down to the inside. Trouble for Danny Tebow in the number 79. We'll see if he can get that refired. He does. We stay green. Thank you, Danny Tebow, as the field comes off of turn number four with two laps to go. It'll be two to go. They take the twin sticks from Steve Bowden. Tim Bolger, your leader. The battle is for second place. Amy Arsenault on the low line. Jake Venator upstairs. Give the advantage down into three and four to Jake Venator in that number 29. White flag is in the air. Final time around for Arsenault and Venator battling for that number two spot. Trouble for the 78 of DJ Tebow, the 20 of Ethan Heilborn. That's after the fact. The leaders roll into turns three and four. Tim Bolger adds his name to the winner's list. Second place to the stripe goes Amy Arsenault. Third place to Jake Venator. Mike Duart fourth and Dane Saratelli rounds out the top five. Congratulations, welcome to Victory Lane. Thanks Kevin, that was a hell of a race. It seemed like it took forever. Yes it did. <laughs> All the cautions and restarts and just held on for it. Thanks to everybody for racing us clean. And uh, picked up a vibration about halfway through the race. Wasn't sure if we'd be able to hold on, but did it. You passed some good trucks on your way to the front. You held off some good trucks on the way to the ch checkered flag. How does it feel to finally get that first win? It feels great. We did it in the Sport 4, and it took us a couple years, and it's nice to pick one up first couple races here in the new truck. So. A lot of people behind you getting ready. Yeah, i got to thank all my sponsors. Um, got Elmwood Collision Center, uh, Zero One Designs with the graphics. Um, my dad, my girlfriend, my mom, uh, just everyone who's helped us get here. Uh, Jimmy Kuhn for the setup. Truck was a rocket ship. Congratulations. Go celebrate in victory lane. How about a